Because the value that we are discussing, which the European unions have agreed to, is actually more than $10,000, XRP has essentially become the new euro. However, this is not the only reason why XRP has become dominant. This news comes at the same time that the CEO of Ripple is meeting with the president of Georgia to discuss the integration of XRP, and the French central bank has announced that XRP will be the first ever designated interface for the digital euro. Of course, that is not all. When the World Bank suggested and classified XRP as a $10,000 stablecoin, it was also confirmed that a $10,000 per XRP was approaching. At the same time, the World Bank stated that $10,000 is the criterion for XRP to be considered a stablecoin. Obviously, before we go headfirst into the incredible film that we have for you today, we need to make a big announcement about a giveaway. We are giving away a large quantity of free XRP, which is worth more than $100, to each and every individual who takes the time to subscribe to the channel with the post notifications, share the video, tap the like button, and most importantly, sign up and uphold by using the link in the description and completing a transaction. Our time is approximately five minutes. The only thing you need to do is sign up, complete a transaction, and you will receive up to $100 worth of free XRP. You can conduct any quantity of transaction, whether it be a penny, a dollar, ten dollars, or any other number. All of that being said, let's go right into the video that we have for today. Beginning with the World Bank's literal designation of XRP as a cross-border stablecoin, we will now discuss. To reiterate, this is a significant piece of information since it would be the first time that XRP is referred to as a stablecoin. Furthermore, it would be a stablecoin with a value of $10,000. Furthermore, it would be emphasized by the World Bank, which is a confirmed financial institution that operates on a global scale. This would not be the first time that a high-level official has actually spoken about a $10,000 per XRP price, despite the fact that it could appear to be rather strange and surprising. On June 3, 2023, Ripple's very own co-founder Arthur Pritchard had actually made a statement in which he discussed how he envisions XRP at $10,000 with global scalability. In the statement, he cited exactly that he believes XRP is designed for $10,000 and that it must be scalable to accommodate 7.5 billion people by the time it is fully implemented. And the verification has also been validated by a number of officials and directors, such as Sean McBride, who was a previous director of Ripple. McBride reported that the World Bank recognized XRP as a stablecoin, and there are rumors circulating about the possibility that XRP may reach $10,000 per coin. To reiterate, this is not the end of the story as Ripple's chief executive officer, also known as the CEO of Ripple, as well as the chief legal officer, also known as the CLO of Ripple, have also discussed the same topic. Let's start the video, shall we? That's an entirely different thing to think about. While we are utilizing the same revolutionary technology, we are doing it in order to construct a value exchange or value web that is not dependent on any particular currency. In other words, if you want to utilize Ripple, you do not need to switch to a different virtual currency. You can use it with any currency you want, including dollars, euros, yuan, or even real. You have a math-based money built into Ripple that is comparable to Bitcoin, but its primary purpose is that of an enabler. Therefore, we believe that the majority of individuals will utilize Ripple by utilizing the value that they already possess, such as dollars, euros, or yuan. So you would be excited about an exchange-traded fund for XRP, right? It is something that we would be really excited about, and I believe that it is unavoidable that there will be several exchange-traded funds based on various tokens. There is a possibility that exchange-traded funds ETFs will be positioned around baskets, which will further diversify the accompanying risk. Because there is a great deal of enthusiasm about the ETF dynamic in this context, I was wondering whether you are in discussions with the major issuer, specifically BlackRock, to get this done. To tell you the truth, I won't be commenting on that. As far as I am aware, BlackRock has made certain statements in public. We are of the opinion that it is reasonable for the XRP community as a whole. Ripple is, without a doubt, a very significant participant in the XRP ecosystem. Nevertheless, we are not the only player in this ecosystem. Before the complaint was filed by the SEC, XRP was the digital asset with the second highest value. I believe that we have now seen it to a significant extent abate as a result of the headwinds caused by that case. When looking at these things from a more long-term perspective, the question that arises is how you can produce usefulness and actually solve problems that occur in the real world using these various digital assets. 
This is something that Bitcoin is doing very well as a store of value. Because of its characteristics of being extremely quick, extremely efficient, and having a low cost on a per transaction basis, XRP is ideally suited for use in the payment process. Ripple has placed a significant emphasis on this aspect of the cryptocurrency. So you guys have literally heard it from Ripple's basically entire team, from Ripple's CEO, Ripple's CEO, Ripple's directors, and everybody else that is a part of Ripple, that XRP is the go-to right now. And it's likely going to make a lot of people a lot of money as it goes ahead, becomes global, and of course, more and more financial institutions begin utilizing the XRP ledger. In this context, however, it is essential to be aware that holders of XRP have already made and will continue to profit over millions of dollars from a relatively small investment of $100. Despite the fact that it is incredible, it is truly taking place, and it has taken place in the past. However, what is even more bizarre is the fact that it is not just XRP that is making people millionaires. In reality, it is the XRP ledger and there are a great number of tokens. In particular, there is one token that we are concentrating on and that we have discussed on this channel in the past. It is known as the CTF token and it is one of the few DeFi tokens that is actually performing some kind of action on the XRP ledger. And yes, it is capable of reaching sky high levels. We are talking about a decline that is all the way from 30 cents to more than $598, as predicted by a number of analysts and specialists, such as Jack the Ripper, who has more than 200,000 followers. And the majority of this is due to the fact that the CTF token has a very low supply on the XRP ledger, despite the fact that it is one of the top 10 XRP ledger tokens. This supply shock is likely going to send it soaring all the way up to more than $500. With the help of this fantastic candle, we were able to obtain concrete evidence that a breakout is on the verge of taking place, and the coin has experienced a large increase of more than 8% in just the past 24 hours. In reality, it was significantly higher than before. It was more or less 52 cents. On the other hand, people, this coin is going to explode. Moreover, in my perspective, what is 40 cents when the potential is more than $500? I made the decision to enter this, so here it is guys. When I looked at it, there was a very small supply, but there was a huge demand for this currency. It is not even possible to find them listed on centralized exchanges. There has not been a campaign of mass marketing carried out by them. As a result, I can only image the enormous demand that is going to emerge once everything starts to take place. A supply shock is about to take place as a result of the small amount of supply that is now available. And of course, when you read analysts and specialists like Jack the Ripper informing you that each CTF token, which is on the XRP ledger, is worth $500, that really just pumped me up even more. This is what I came to the conclusion of. It is possibly the best course of action. And in the end, I found myself purchasing CTF tokens and filling my bag with them. I went so far as to conduct additional study on the subject, folks. Because this is basically the only token on the XRP ledger and the Polygon chain that generates passive revenue, I am able to state that this is a fantastic currency. This is because I have been able to produce passive money with the use of this coin. It is a community-driven and creative network that gives you the opportunity to create passive income simply by holding the token without having to do anything else. Also, it goes without saying that the more coins you have, the more passive revenue you will generate. In light of this, I have been stuffing my luggage. I will proceed to fill my bag, and it will proceed to perform the CTF token analysis throughout the process. At this moment,